you might need to use these shooting badges to increase your three point percentage man in NBA 2K23 I'm finna give you the best updated shooting badges in season 6 man leave a like and subscribe Alright man, hopping straight into the video ladies and gentlemen. We finna knock out the settings real quick man. This will help give you extra boost and things of that nature. So go to your controller settings man. I low key have vibration on and shot meter off. You feel me? If you cannot shoot whatsoever with shot meter off, maybe you need to find a new jump shot. But if you're just better with the meter, use the meter. Now the shot timing release time. I run it on late, man. I run on late. I feel like it helps with you know the little bit of the lag and the latency in the game. But I run it on late and really make sure you have the shot meter off. You get a boost. Everybody should know this, man. It's been in the game vibration. It helps you to remember your arm, um, the release timing of your jump shot, and then. The new addition, man. I don't know. I'm running on late or early. Late or early, depending on your preference, man. So, those are the quick controller settings you need to change to be able to green 100% of your threes, bro. I'm not gonna lie, we is on current gen, but obviously it is the same badges on next gen. But we're talking about shooting, man. I am on my center build to where I have a 75 three-pointer and just to help out the people that have you know not 20 plus shooting badges man so let's hop into it man and so I recommend catch and shoot man I recommend catch and shoot if you have a low three next next man on the list really agent threes I mean I will only tell you to put this on if you ISOing you feel me if you you're like you know doing any dribble moves with a low three-pointer you feel me in between 70 79 go ahead and pop on agent threes it don't matter comeback kid which is very very underrated man but only works if you're losing i think by more than five points i don't know but hey man if you do be losing a lot go ahead throw on that badge green machine now obviously man you need to max out green machine if you can't shoot at all you feel me using more than one three different jump shots you gotta toss on green machine man midi i don't use midi but obviously if your midi is like you know 90 plus you gotta throw that on volume shooter is a very secret badge nobody really knows about man i recommend silver but since you only have 14 badges we have to put it on bronze man all right let's move over to limitless range you already know to throw that on man that should be simple dead eye you definitely need dead eye on any build if you're shooting man you definitely need dead eye all right since you a center center or if you're not a center you feel me you don't have to throw on slippery but if you're a center put that puppy on bronze man you feel me obviously you set screens you pop you roll throw that on there I will honestly use the rest on Amped, you feel me? Amped will probably be my final suggestion. Put Green Machine on Bronze and um, I would throw on Clutch Shooter. Psych, I forgot about, I'm tripping, bro. I forgot about Corner Specialist, bro. Corner Specialist and um, Let's see. It's either guard up or clutch shooter. So I'm going to go clutch shooter, man. But these are the 14 badges, man. I recommend. I have a 75 three pointer on this build. You feel me? And um, I feel like this will maximize your green window and your chances, man, to make shots on a low three point build. How we fit to get into my 90 plus three pointer build? all right man i am on my diamond three-point shooter build man i have a 93 on this build so we just been able to the shooting badges and as you can see i didn't even unlock all 24 i have 19 right now but um yeah you feel me i have an iso build you feel me so i rock agent threes man on silver 
I put catch and shoot on bronze because sometimes, you feel me, I just be open off the catch and shoot, you feel me? Come back, kid, because, like I said, bro, I don't know. I be, I be down a lot in the game. I be having to fight back. Come my teammates be selling. You feel me? Green machine. In a game where it's kind of difficult to shoot, you need green machine, bro. That only makes sense. Volume shooter. If you're taking more than three shots a game, you need volume shooter on silver so you can get that boost, man. So you could feel me? So you could get that boost, man. You need that boost. Um, Amped. Since I dribble a lot on this build, I'm going to make it gold. I'm going to make it gold. So I would go gold or Hall of Fame depending on how much um, badges you have. But I'm going to go gold, man. I run guard up. And um, limitless, silver. Once I get the rest of my badges dead, I will be silver. Because, you feel me? We're going to be shooting lights out. You can't guard me. Got that clutch shooter on, man. I got blinders on. Nothing really need to be said there. And Spacey Cre Space Creator, I'm testing that badge out. They, it's not really working for me when I create space. But um, if you don't want um, Space Creator, slap on guard up, you feel me? Or, you know, if you got a high midi, midi magician, you feel me? That's very underrated midi magician if you know you specialize in the mid-range area, you feel me? So... That's it, man. It's really a short video today. That's all I got for y'all as in the best badges, man, in the game that I recommend for any three-point build, any shooting build, man. You feel me? So leave a like and subscribe, and I'm going to catch you on the next video, man. Peace.